Today we are going to show you how to find n-gons, uh, n-gons and triangles. So when you are working with either Maya or you're working with 3ds Max, you need to sometimes find out where things don't connect right or where your certain geometry is. So we are in Maya currently and what we are going to do to find n-gons is simply go into the face mode and we are going into the select tool here we are going into use constraints and then with use constraints all we have to do is check in n sided and then we can go all in next and these are all of our end gods uh, so these will actually show you all the places that end gods are uh, prevalent in your model if you do the same thing in triangles you can actually find all of those two just by checking that box now one of the things that you have to remember in Maya um, I always find that students run into this that if you check something and then you hit uh, close and remember what's going to happen is ultimately you want to you are constraining those points so when you have that it's perfectly fine but from then on you won't be able to select the other uh, the regular geometry or even triangles so you have to remember that um, so when you close this uh, basically you can say close and reset and that will set it back to nothing um, so that you can actually go through and select the individual pieces um, and that's how you select the triangles and end guns in Maya in 3ds max it is just as simple we're going to go into the polygons we are going to go up into our modeling uh, ribbon here. We're gonna go into selection and we are going to select four sides greater than and just hit select. If you wanna do triangles, you do four sides less than and you hit select and we'll select those. And that is as easy as it is. And from there, you can actually go in and manipulate your geometry to get rid of them. Thanks for watching.